I'm Karina, your personal trainer. Today I'm here to talk to you about um, tans that turn orange or that turn patchy. A lot of times you see people with their tan on and their tan looks a bit patchy or very orange. Um, this doesn't mean that they, they had an orange tan or the tan is like that or is a bad um, tan. It, um, what it can be, some people get a tan on top of a tan, on top of a tan. They don't think exfoliating is necessary and it's completely necessary. Your tan will definitely not look good if you do not exfoliate, okay? Even if you're using a gradual tan, sometimes you have to do a little, depending how, um, how long after you had your tan, you have to exfoliate lightly okay just lightly go with the exfoliation before you put exfoliating mate before you apply your gradual tint because even that will look a uh, very fake if you put on top of another tan like i tend to our skin shred very often okay once a week we should be exfoliating if we're getting a tan weekly minimum okay i sometimes need to exfoliate twice before i get my tan because my skin holds it very well. My tans last 10 days plus, if I let. But of course, by the end of it, it just doesn't look all right. I have to exfoliate. Um, so please don't. Do not apply a tan if you already have a tan. Remove it. Exfoliate it very well, especially in your know, dry areas like elbows, knees, um, heels. Exfoliate it. It doesn't take time. It's just five minutes. Less than that, you go, ch -ch 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 -ch, done, okay? Otherwise, your tan, doesn't matter how beautiful the application is, your tan will look fake. Exfoliate. No tan on top of tan, okay? That's a no-no. See you next time.